Hello Sage, welcome to your almost daily love reading. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for subscribing to my channel. I really appreciate your love and support. Hope all is well with everyone and such. Please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it will not resonate with each and every one of you. Time is an illusion in tarot, so this reading could resonate with you in the past, currently, or in the future, okay? And such, let's find out what are your love messages today? Spirits and angels, please show me important, accurate love messages for Sagittarius today. Please show me more. One of the deck is the Eight of Pentacles. Let's see. Hmm. I definitely say, see somebody from your past. Such so what is going on? All these past people wanting wanting to come back. Um, but anyway, I do see a page of cups. Someone may want to come back and apologize because I see also the death card in reverse. So definitely indicating somebody here not accepting that this connection is over and wanting to heal this connection with the star and we've got the strength here uh, so that you could be dealing with a leo pisces cancer scorpio strong pisces and strong aquarius scorpio again a virgo cancer you do have quite a number of major arcanas here one two three four five six you have six major arcana that means um such a lot of things are going to change if you allow it to change okay um because the chariot is in reverse here so it looks like um maybe this is somebody from the past or it could also be you right roles can be reversed but Someone is feeling still very stuck in the past and can't quite move on, can't quite move forward, but they are holding back with the strength card here. They may have a huge ego. Someone here may have a huge ego and sort of like holding back and not wanting to express how they feel. Um, and they're just distracting themselves by working on themselves or, or focusing on work or career. The hangman is right here. I do see that your connection with this person is at a pause right now. Uh, you guys may not be speaking a lot, or, you know, or at all, okay? Um, taking a break, basically. Taking a break, trying to see things in different perspectives. But also, I'm seeing such someone is just waiting for the other person to reach out, okay? Um, the strength card to me yeah it's it speaks about to me it's like an ego thing as well so someone is just uh waiting for the other person to make the first move okay but at the same time yeah at the same time the ace of ace of wands is in reverse here so it looks like someone may not want to reignite this connection yeah i do see somebody here wants to re Want, wanting to revisit the past but the other person does not want to um, they're just burying themselves with work and or just working on themselves and putting themselves in an isolation mode here with the hermit card and trying to soul search trying to seek from within trying to reflect on things um, the holding back uh, part with the strength card here. I just feel like someone, you know, someone, it's not like they don't want to reconcile. I feel like it's more like an ego thing or trying to do the right thing as well, okay? Because the hermit is very wise. So trying to make sure that they are actually making the right decision, doing the right thing. And the chariot is in reverse, so uh, there's no forward movement in terms of your connection with this person. Currently, it looks like there is an intention with the Page of Cups here for somebody to offer uh, an apology or to reconcile or to give you a peace offering. Again, roles can be reversed. But we've got a Queen of Wands here, so this could be you, Sagittarius, Leo, 
Aries, but it doesn't really matter. Don't take the signs too seriously. We all can embody any of these energy. But the Queen of Wands, I do see her usually as the third party, right? The other woman or the other man, um, because she is also sitting right next to three of three of Pentacles in reverse and three of Cups in an upright position. So it looks like this could have been a third party situation. Okay. Um, for some of you, but third party may not always mean another lover. It could mean external factors, internal factors, friends or family who could have um, meddled into this connection and causing it to end, right? I do see that you guys are going through a separation or taking a break here because the hermit usually appears after uh, an ending. Uh, a breakup or a separation and also got the death card here although it's in reverse um, that means it was in an upright position before so maybe somebody wants to come back and you know um, trying to revive okay or to resuscitate this connection here but the four of pentacles is in reverse and the three of pentacles in reverse i do see one person probably is kind of like trying to you know make some peace offering or uh or to say that that they are sorry or wanting to meet up with you face to face but i feel like the other person whether it's you or them again um, roles can be reversed, may not want to accept it, may not want to accept, uh, may not want to meet in the middle or to cooperate or to fix things because I do see the three of pentacles in reverse. Four of pentacles also is in reverse, so it's a sense of, you know, letting go, letting go. And with the star here, yeah, I do see that um, Either somebody wants to heal this connection with you or that, you know, maybe you are just trying to go through some uh, healing process, you know, learning self-love. But I definitely, yeah, Sage, maybe someone here just needs uh, some time to think about things and to reflect because the Two of Pentacles, you know, it could mean also somebody juggling between two person, but at the same time, it's also about weighing pros and cons and feeling unsure uh, as in, you know, what to choose or what to do here. So uh, also to me, it's similar. Number two is like, a choice that someone needs to make you know whether to carry on to heal this connection and carry on with this connection but you know someone here is definitely thinking and trying to be wise in making their choice here okay whether to stay or to to stay and heal this connection or to actually leave okay but i don't see anything uh, i just feel like right now uh, your energy with this person is kind of stagnant okay it's not actually moving anywhere as of yet because i feel like somebody here needs to take some time out to think about to think about things you know to make sure that they're making the right decision um, in regards to this connection all right Sash, this is your reading i hope you resonated if you did please hit like share and subscribe and also i only do emergency reading my information is in the description box below if you'd like to book me if nothing else i hope to see you tomorrow as i post your video almost every single day take care Sash. bye